Yo, 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 what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Double A Now Skills. Welcome back to the Arsenal Career Mode. Ladies and gentlemen, look at that, man. Cristiano Ronaldo moved to uh, 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 Arsenal, as you guys already know. My boy, Gabriel Jesus, went to Barcelona. Kula Bali over to Real Madrid. Vardy goes to Liverpool. Uh, Richarlison to Atletico Madrid. Depay to Inter. Uh, yo, some pretty crazies. Lamar went to Man City. Dembele goes over to RB. Um, Lacazette back to Lyon. Is he, didn't he come from Lyon? Maybe I'm crazy. Um, PK went over to uh, Spurs. A lot has taken place, baby. A lot, a lot has gone down. Ferro went to Germany. Marcelo went to PSG. Oh, that makes sense, actually. Lendeloff to Crystal Palace. There has been a lot of moves, man. Without further ado, welcome back to the Arsenal career mode. Can we get a big thumbs up on the video if you haven't already? And yes, indeedy, don't be greedy. Your boy Skillsy is about to jump in and actually do training. Y'all thought that I wasn't going to do it, but I'm going to do it. I'm going to get the trainings done. I'm going to make sure that you guys get the content that you want to see. That's what we're going to do, baby. Is that what I was supposed to do? Am I supposed to score as well? Oh, keep going, baby. Oh, keep going, baby. Woo! Oh, miss. All right. So, in this drill, I got an A. I'm not going to lie, bro. I went back in the other drill. <laughs> and I only got a C. I accidentally choked it. Wait, what do I got to do here? Is this defending? Boys, I got one more attempt at it. And as y'all can see, we did perfect. So, I did great. The first one, I don't know how I only got a C. But I choked, my boys. Please don't, don't judge me, okay? I only got a C. Don't, don't, don't judge your boy. But again, y'all told me you wanted to see your boy doing training. And that's exactly what I'm doing. All right. So, we got an offer from my boy Chambers. And it's from Benfica. And, uh, of course, we're going to sit down and negotiate. Chambers is not somebody I'm in kind of a rush to sell. But any type of money's coming in will be really important because your boy has a very, 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 I don't know. I, I want to say I got a very, very um, big thing on my mind. A real big thing. So picking up some money here could be huge. But if you could try to negotiate this one with me real quick. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to get 30 million for cha uh, 13 million for Chambers. Um, our final ad offer is 11 and that's going to put us at 102 million. So I'm going to say yes. Chambers, thank you for everything you've done at the club. Enjoy your time in Lisbon. You'll love it out there. I promise you it's a great club. Enjoy it, my boy. All right, man. Right back on it, bro. I'm telling y'all right now. I'm doing my trainings. I know this is weird for y'all to see from me. But I got to get my training in. This is something y'all really want. So do I just cross the ball here? I'm assuming. Is that what you do? Bang? I guess we just try to get... Oh. We just got to try to get points, right? Guys, I'm never really good at these. I'm going to be 100% real with y'all. Ah, I could do better. I could do better. I could do better. Retry that drill. A, 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 my boys. Yeah! Come on! All right, we get a cheeky little loan deal in. Um, I'm obviously going to let this go through as well. Nice little loan deal. We're going to let this happen, my boys. Um, Here's the deal. Uh, I know a lot of y'all are going to freak out, so I just want to talk to y'all, you know, man to man or man to female, whoever's watching this, man. I love you guys. Appreciate y'all watching my content. Um, you know, I, 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 I'm trying to build the best team in the world, you know? And um, when you're trying to build the best team in the world, you want the best players. I know this is about, like, not as realistic as it can get. But all the time, clubs from the same league try to steal players from me. So, would it be so bad if I try to steal VVD? Honestly, would it would it really be that bad if I just went out there and, and, and quickly stole a VVD? I don't really know how to make this happen. But I really, really want to make it happen. Um, again, do I think it's actually possible? Probably not. Um, but you know what, dude? In life, it's always worth a try, bro. It really is, man. It's always worth a try. So, at this point, I don't really have players for a lot. But what I do got is a player like Xhaka, who uh, really isn't going to play much here. And I also got Uzil, who I haven't really figured out what I'm going to do with him yet. So, what I'm going to do is go ahead and offer Xhaka. And after offering Xhaka... I'm going to offer 90 million to see what Klopp says about this offer. And again, bro, um, they want 140 plus Xhaka. I'll give you 111 plus Xhaka. 
139. Yo. 120. I'm not going to have the money. 125. Guys, I legitimately have just agreed terms with Liverpool, but I will not have the funds to sign VVD. Yeah! Yo, if I could somehow find the funds, I could actually make this work. Yeah, nah, this is the craziest thing I've ever seen in my life. This is actually the craziest thing I've ever seen in my life. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a, we have a chance here to bring VVD, VVD to the club. Um, I don't, I don't really know what to say. His wages. I, I, nah, it, it's just never gonna happen, bro. It, it, we can't, bro. Look at look at his wages. I'm broke. I'm legitimately broke. If I give him a sign-on bonus, guys, he's gonna run away, bro. He's gonna run away. I don't want him to run away, man. I really don't want you. I, I don't run away, bro. Listen, 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 bro. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, because of the other one. Remove the bonuses. Yo. Dude, listen. All I got for you right now is this. But you get to leave Liverpool and you get to come to a new challenge, bro. You know, and you get to play with Cristiano Ronaldo, which which in my opinion is pretty cool, man. You know, it's it's kind of a cool, it's kind of a cool thing, man. Come on. Don't be mad. Ah. VVD, please, sir. VVD, you get you get to play with Cristiano, dude. You get to play with Cristiano Ronaldo, dude. Like, we can do great things together, me and you. We can legitimately do great things. No, that won't be good enough. We thought we were coming here to tie up the deal. VVD, 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 wait for me, bro. Ah! Ah, VVD, bro. Come on, man. I couldn't make VVD happen. But what about if Zidane's willing to let go? What if Zidane is willing to let go of Ramos? Xhaka for Ramos, bro. He wants 47 million. Hey, hey, hey. What about if I give you a player that used to play for y'all goes by the name of Uzil? Oh no, not in that money. No, 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 no. Oh wow, you are so dumb. You could have got 40 million in? Bro, you are so dumb right now. Why didn't you take that dummy? Yo, this is the dumbest CPU I've ever seen in my life. I'll give you 30 million, he's old bro, 30 million. 47? Yo, 47 for Ramos? Are you serious right now? Damn, you ain't budging? You for real? I gotta speak to the board before I make this move happen for a 34 year old. Yo, he ain't budging. Yo, I'm gonna accept it, but guys, I don't think that's, nah, 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 nah. I don't think that's going down like that, bro. This guy is absolutely crazy. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, man. I, I, oh, we got an offer, Xhaka. That's crazy. Finally an offer, bro. That's what I like to see. All right, uh, what do we want? We want anywhere from 25 to 37, guys. Dudes, I'm going to be real. I, I I I wanted to steal VVD. I did, bro. I wanted to put Alaba and VVD in the back and just make Arsenal just a remarkable, a remarkable um, 31. Hey, that's not a bad. Listen, give us 33. Let's lock this up. Y'all take Xhaka. We're chilling. Done deal. Xhaka. Thank you, bro. We can afford VVD. Oh, baby, baby. That came out of nowhere, bro. Yo, we can actually get VVD now, dude. Uh-oh, dude. Uh-oh, dude. Uh-oh, dude. I'm about to twist this league upside down, baby girl. I'm about to flip this league upside down, baby girl. Southampton, ultimate difficulty, five minute hash. We got Obama and Ronaldo, Pepe, and my man Gabriel. Party Danny, my man Gabriel in the back. We got that boy Bellerine and my boy Alaba and Turney. 
Uh, but I'm actually going to switch it up just a little bit. Not a lot, baby girl. Shaka going into that lineup for the starting game of um, the season. And also, I'm going to throw the French center back up in there as well. Nah, let's leave Gab Gabrielle's hecka slow, I'm, by the way. I'm, I'm not even capping. Um, as always, we'll start off watching The Sims. Second half, I take over. You guys know how it goes. Uh, ultimate difficulty. Try to make it real difficult. And um, yeah, let's get it going. Now, if you missed the last episode, we were a goal scoring mat machine. I think the game ended 5-5 or 4-4 in the Shield Cup. And then we lost in penalties to Liverpool. Great team. I mean, obviously, Liverpool is one of the best teams. No, no, no. Let me take that back. Liverpool is the best team in Europe. right? And, and, and the best team. Can't say the best team in Europe no more. But the best team in the Prem, can we say that? Can we say that the best team in the Prem? Are we cool to say that? How are we saying? Yeah, we're saying that. Best team in the Prem, uh, unbelievable team. They're great. They're fantastic. No doubt about it. It has to be said. So it is what it is. But with that being said, uh, I'm very sad. We lost on penalties. Oh, we almost scored right there. Bro, who's number 19? Oh, yeah, Pepe. Um, I'm very sad we lost on pens. Oh, we almost scored again. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Good passing. And we lose out in the 24th minute. I'm ready to get in this, man. I'm ready to go play, dude. Because y'all ain't cooking up no barbecue chicken. And I want to see y'all playing better footy, man. We did our training. I'm so proud of us, man. We're doing training. We're looking at the youth. We're buying players. Everything is going well for this Arsenal side right now, man. This Arsenal career mode is on point, And I'm loving it. I'm enjoying it so much. Nice one, too. Cristiano Ronaldo no Pavier. Vamos! Be very, very, very nicely done, bro. 31st minute. We are up by one because of big boy Aubameyang and big boy Cristiano Ronaldo. Big chance right before halftime. Ah, man, right to the keeper's hands. How we feeling, boys? I, I feel like we've done pretty good. We make it to halftime. I kind of want to jump in, but at the same time, I kind of want to let the boys just roll. Uh, I'm going to be bringing in that boy, uh, Willian. Go at the left the left, the, the left, left mid position. And I ask you guys this all the time in, uh, in, in, in the comments. And what I've been seeing, and I want to make sure I understand this right. Obviously, training helps a lot with the development of a player. But I also heard that using the development thing is really important. Like going in there, making sure you put the players working on the right things. And as you do that, their sprint speed goes up and all that stuff goes up. So what's impo more important, the development side of stuff or the training side of stuff to develop the player to get his overall higher and higher as quickly as possible? Or is it doing both? Nice opportunity right here in Colasso! Willian off the bench! 2-0! We might simulate the entire game. Um, maybe I should jump in. Nah, I'm thinking about... Nah, maybe we should simulate... I don't know. What are y'all thinking, bros? I don't know. How y'all feel? Cristiano goes up to the boy Party. Party looking for something. Can't find it. They goes to Aubameyang. Aubameyang can make it a third! Go. Look on, look on, look on, look on. Oh, we love you, Arsenal. We do. We love you, Arsenal. We do. We love you, Arsenal. We do. Oh, Arsenal, we love you. Come on, boys. There it is, my boys. Big boy Aubameyang finds his second goal in the Premier League. Beautiful. No. No. I passed it out bad, bro. Big chance. Southampton. What a save, Leno. 89th minute. That's the three points in the bag. My boy Leno just saved us so wow, bro. I don't even know how to say thank you to that man, bro. What an absolute remarkable save, bro. That was heroic. Because if they score right there, oh, that's a ball. That's a ball to party. That's a ball. The counterattack is clean. Aubameyang can get his hat trick if Party plays this correctly. Party's still with it. I'm going to swing it down to Aubameyang and the hat trick for Aubameyang. Ladies and gentlemen, Cristiano Ronaldo joined the club. And they thought that was going to push Aubameyang out. Was going to make him not the number one goal scorer here at Arsenal. But that ain't how it's going down, baby. We're building around Aubameyang. Ronaldo's just another piece to make this Arsenal team great again, man. We're looking to be the Invincibles. We're looking not to lose a game. We're looking to break the record. We're looking to do what this badge did years ago. I mean, it really is a huge result, bro. It, it, it's the perfect result as well. Liverpool got off to the perfect start, and we get off to the perfect start. And I still can't believe that they agreed to sell VVD. Like, they agreed it, man. Uh, talks with Chambers and um, Befica have broken down. That's crazy. Sergio Ramos has, you know, we can go ahead and go with that. But I don't know, boys. I don't really know if I want Ramos, man. Do I just stay in the circle? Oh, I stay in the circle and then you finish. Oh, okay. That's pretty easy. All right, you get points. Then you turn and then you pop. Oh, I like this drill. Give me a run. Give me a run. Give me a run. It's almost like sometimes they don't be listening. Uzo, you got to score this, bro. Nice, baby. So another A. Well done. Well done. See results. I believe we got B, 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 A, A in our training. Well done. That's what it's about. Another day of training, boys. And I got to be honest with you. Xhaka showed, which means we do have enough money 
uh we do have enough money for freaking cristiano i mean uh for 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 vvd which is just absolutely crazy so what am i supposed to do here all right boys there you have it man as you can see your boy is taking this arsenal career mode as serious as possible everything you guys ask for in the comments down below i'm trying to make sure i do that for you guys man it's important that you guys are happy and in the comments down below that you guys are happy and that you guys are enjoying watching uh we're not letting this guy go on loan i need him but again man it's one of those things where it's like yo do we go back for vvd man because i'm in a position where y'all I, I really wouldn't mind to have vvd at the club uh, negotiations with Ramos are over. I feel like that just wasn't the right move, to be honest. I do have my eyes on another center back, uh, and I'll let you guys know about it real soon. Offer for Leno, um, for 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 a lot of for 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 you know a great CD, a great center back, and eight million. I, I, I'm not gonna lie, that's that's a, that's a solid deal. Uh, but I'm gonna reject it because you know I need my guy, man. We got an offer here for holding. He's 24 years young. I'm not, I don't know, man. I don't Do we let him go? You guys let me know in the comments down below. I don't think we let him go, but I got my eyes on the center back that I actually want to bring into the club. Um, so I'm going to keep my eyes peeled to the screen with that. See what they say once the scouts come back. We're probably going to be bringing a center back in, but this career mode, man, it's been kicked off to a great start, bro. I'm going to be a, keep it 100 with you guys, bro. Um, I love the fact that we're getting the training done. I love the fact that we won the first game the way we run it with Obama and getting a hat trick. I love the fact that... um. You know, we haven't done too many crazy signings. I know Cristiano Ronaldo was a real, real crazy signing, but I want to be 100% real with you guys and tell you why I did it. Um, We have like, so sad to say, we got like another year or two of Cristiano Ronaldo in FIFA. You know what I mean? Like eventually he's going to retire. I don't know how long we have of him, but it's going to happen. So I just think like with Ronaldo and Messi, it's cool to have fun with them in FIFA while we have them still. Because we're going to have to hope that EA is able to get the license to make these guys legends. But even when they make them legends, they're no longer going to be in career mode. So I just really, really enjoy playing with them. Like in one of these career modes coming up, you best believe I'm going to buy Messi. You best believe I'm going to bring Messi to a different team beside Barcelona. Because it's almost over, bro. The GOATs are almost gone, man. And it's just so sad to, you know, to know that this day is coming. It's so sad. Um... But that's the reason I really did it. Second half will be ours, man. We're taking on Burnley. Remember, we won our first game 3-1. And then the typical Arsenal would lose this game. Uh, Arsenal fans don't get mad at me when I say that. But typical Arsenal would lose this game. And look, typical Arsenal, bro. Typical Arsenal come out, make a great game against Southampton. Perform like, oh my God, this is it, boys. We're going to win the league. And then the following game, you show up and you play a disaster of, of a second game. And you lose a game that you really thought you should have won. That's typical Arsenal. Yo, look how far that center back is. Why is he that far back? What about Aubameyang? What about Aubameyang? Don't miss, Golasso! Grab the ball. No celebrating. No celebrating. No celebrating. Grab the wall. Grab the ball. Come on, man. No celebrating, bro. We don't celebrate a draw, bro. We're not celebrating no draw. Let's go. Get the ball back, boys. How are we not on this ball? What a pass. Burnley does it again. Yeah, that's crazy. Nah, nah. That's actually crazy. That's actually crazy. Keeper with a huge save. Unlucky. Time to whip it in. It's going towards the middle. Cristiano! Cristiano! Cristiano Ronaldo! Cri grab the ball, Ronaldo! Ronaldo, grab... Oh, my goodness, bro. I'm going crazy. Another chance for Burnley. Another chance for Burnley. Another good pass. Another interception. A shot! And it's in. Nah, bro. You have got to be joking, man. Burnley hits the back of the net for the third time. And we are once again losing. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Come on. Cristiano. He has to slow down for a second. I go to Ganduzi. This is Ganduzi. Still Ganduzi. Straight through the middle. Ganduzi. Ganduzi. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Come on, boys. Come on, come on, come on. Ganduzi. Straight up the middle. Come on. To Aubameyang. I have nowhere to go. Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano. Ah! Cristiano Ronaldo. Ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, Cristiano Ronaldo, come on! <laughs> Yo, this is crazy. I told you I was building a different arsenal. We are built different. We are built different, my boys. We are built to succeed. We are built to win the craziest game you will see in the Premier League this season. And for the first time in a long time, it's not against Arsenal. It's for Arsenal. So many times this would happen against arsenal but not no more boys it's a different arsenal we built different baby we built different big time finish from big time players baby big boy ganduzi 
Hit the run. Cristiano finds him. Look at the run straight up the middle. Nobody guarded him. Bang. Near post finish. Well done. Then Cristiano. Same thing. I knew I could run at this defense. So I gave it to him with Aubameyang. And Cristiano bangs near post. Huge game for the boys. Also, let's not forget the big goal off the corner from the Portuguese man, Cristiano. Absolutely unbelievable. Aubameyang tied it all up with Cristiano's assist. And I guess the thing that we got to say is wow what a game from cristiano almost in every single goal game i mean uh every single play that was important cristiano ronaldo hit the back of the net ladies and gentlemen arsenal they built different bros they built different bros that was tough the undefeated season stays alive it stays alive ladies and gentlemen hope you enjoyed the episode you can see at the bottom left of your screen big boy clusterman maybe on his way to arsenal it could be happening the center back we need the man that we must see come to arsenal is it him let me know in the comments down below big old thumbs up subscribe i'll catch you tomorrow booyah we out what a game bruh